There are a lot of different ways to watch the eclipse here in Metamora. You could be surrounded by thousands of cookie jars and eating some ice cream. As a Knights Templar surrounded by a medieval collection, or just take in nature outside, make sure you've got your eclipse glasses though. Yeah, it's gonna be huge for the business community, but we have people from as far away as um, London, England that are, that are coming to Franklin County. We have over 3,200 different cookie jars. At Granny's Cookie Jar. Now this is what we call a scoop at Granny's. It'll be scoops up. Two seven foot freezers out back. Owner Connie Ragel is ordering double what she normally would this time of year, 168 gallons. A lot of ice cream. Lots of ice cream. <laughs> Many of the shops here are family owned and supported by tourism. So we just recently celebrated our 100, over 100 years here. Astronomy is about to give them a boost and they're going all in. I don't think I got the scope of it, that it could be as big as it could be. Bill and Karen Smith's bed and breakfast has been booked since January. Their store now selling eclipse glasses. Well, we're hoping that, you know, the experience will be much more than that three minute period, even though that'll be historical for, for them as individuals. Success isn't just about the eclipse weekend. It's about showing that it's worth visiting Metamora again. For them to come and realize, wow, it's a great place of history a great place of beauty, a, a place to just relax and to see some wonderful shops. Wonderful shops in a town now spotted with flyers, magazines and logoed glasses. I am uh, a little nervous for the amount of people who could possibly be in here. I mean, we handle it for Canal Days, no problem, but we know what to expect in Canal Days. We don't really know what to expect on Eclipse, eclipse Day, so. Metamora is nearly ready. And we make our waffle cones, so I got to start making waffle cones next week. <laughs> the moon's shady business driving business. Well, we're ready, so bring them on. In Metamora, Andrew Rowan, WCPO 9 News.